Start with the divisibility test of 5. A number is said to be divisible by 5 if it is having 0 or 5 at its units place or it at its ones place. Example 1 is the number is 39010. If we want to check whether it is divisible by 5 or not, we have to check its units place. There is 0 in its units place, so yes, the number is divisible by 5. In the next example, the number is 4915. Here also the units place contain 5, so the condition for divisibility by 5 is it either should, it should have 0 or 5. So yes, the number is divisible by 5. In example 3, the number is 2913. There is 3 at its units place, so obviously the number is not divisible by 5. So here, 2913 is not divisible by 5 as there is not, neither 0 nor 5 at its units place. Now let us check the divisibility by 10. To check the divisibility by 10, a number should contain 0 at its units place. So here in the first example, the number is 2910. So obviously as there is 0 at its units place, so the number is divisible by 10. In the example 2, the number is 6664. It is not having 0 at its units place, so the number will not be divisible by 10. So hence to check a number whether it is divisible by 10 or not, it should have 0 at its units place or at its ones place. So here children, we have done the divisibility test of 5 and 10. Hope you have understood the topic very carefully and you will be able to now complete all the questions related to the divisibility test of 10, 5, 2, 6, 3 and 9. Good morning children. Today we are going to start with the divisibility test of 4. The divisibility test of 4 says that a number with 3 or more digits is divisible by 4 if the number formed by the last two digits is divisible by 4. For example, if we have the number 21084, we have to check the number formed by the last two digits here. And the number formed by the last two digits is 84. Now you can easily check that the number formed by the last two digits of this number is divisible by 4 or not either by simple multiplication tables or if you want to use the division method you can. Now let us check is 84 divisible by 4? 4 2s are 8 and 4 is that is 4. So we have no remainders left over here. So as 84 is divisible by 4, so the complete number will be divisible by 4. In greater than 4, we have to write this as the number 4 by last 2 digits that is 84 is divisible by or 
or you can use the divisibility test, divisibility method that is 4, 2 is 8 and you are left with the remainder part. Now the number that is formed by the last digits as we see is not divisible by 4. So the complete number will not be divisible by 4. In within what you are going to write as the number That is 0 by or simply 9 is not divisible by 4. Therefore, the complete number that is 793409 is not divisible by 4. Formed by 
last three digits that is triple zero or you can simply write zero is divisible by eight therefore one two three triple zero is divisible by eight